Hello everyone, today we will summarize the story of the rules here. One upon a time, they have a princess. She go up with the queen, her mother and a fairy. She will be joined to a prince who live a rich way off. The time passed. She got ready to set up on her journey to her country. The mother packed on the sails and royal garment for her daughter. She gave her waiting maid. Each had a horse. The princess' horse were a fairy gift. Each were called for ladders and could speak. The fairy cut a lock of her hair. Each is a charm. The princess saw charity, but the waiting maid didn't fish her some water. The princess gets off the horse and ring herself. A little further, she touched it again. The princess yes, is herself. She pained too much, and the lock hair fell into the river and flew away. The maid betrayed to the princess. She wants to be her. She compelled the princess to take off the clothes. The maid become the princess. Finally, they arrived at the royal palace. The princess went to meet them and took the maid as it would be right. The maid compelled. The princess had curtains who take care of the gear. The maid scared the horse talk about the story. Flutter was killed. The princess begged the man to nail off Flutter his skin. Uh, a large dust gate of the city, which she had to pass every morning and evening. He already and now the heads up. Every morning she talked with Falada. Then uh, she went out of the city with Kirkens. She let down her waving lock of hair. When Kirkens saw it glitter in the sun and now pushed it off, she cried and she sings. The queen below of Kirkens head over the hill. By the time they came back, the head done coming and curling her hair. The tempting great speech for today. Kirkens ran to the old king complaining. She said instead of doing the reset, the nothing and not him on day. The king didn't believe about that. And Kirkens had to tell the king the true story. The next day, the king followed them on day. The old king saw and as he went back uh, without being seen. In the evening, the king called her aside and asked her why she did this. She cried and tell him about the true story. And he was very lucky for her that she did so. He wanted her to rest as a reset. The king talked about the story with the prince. The young prince rejoiced when he saw her beauty. The king ordered a rich feast. Nobody knew the princess. Uh, when they had eaten and run, uh, they were very merry. The old king asked for a sanction. He told on the story of the princess. Then he asked the maid, What she does out to be done so Anyone who was behind us, she answered him, The betrayer should be roused in a child forever. Then the king's business lies, he says. The young kings were married to his two wives and had been it on their leave. The fairy came to and now restored for ladder to live again.